repeat 10, 7 to 10 seconds before attempting any question. Yes, same. Here I will prove with the help of remade previous question. My first question is, if this determinant is equal to ax minus 12, then what is the value of a? If we solve this question by expansion, it would be randy and waste of our time, which will also factor accuracy. Here, I put a logic. x equal to 1, both sides. Then this question will be cake for you. After simplification, this determinant is equal to a minus 12. Now, expand through row 1. As we know, we can expand by 6 ways. After simplification, we get a equal to 24. The correct choice is B. My second question is, if this determinant is equal to 0, then what is the value of sin square a plus sin square b plus sin square c? Here I will use the property of determinant. That is, if any two row or columns are same, then the determinant value is 0. In this question, determinant is equal to 0. It means two columns must be same. Hence, A equal to B equal to C. This is the case of equilateral triangle. As we know, in equilateral triangle, all sides and angles are same. That is, each angle is 60 degree. Here I will put the value of angle A, angle B, angle C is 60 degree. As we know, sin 60 degree is root 3 by 2. After simplification, we get 9 by 4. The correct choice is A. Best of luck. Bye-bye.